today we are going to do an outline test effect using a pixel lab so first of all let me set up my color let me put this one as the color this color as the main color the background color so let me go to fix it to my gallery and then import the image that i will be using so i'll be using this image i'll be using this image yeah so let me just expand it a little bit let me expand it uh, yeah this is okay so i will just centralize it here so what will happen now is i will create the text which is let me just put outline yeah put it in capital here uh, or purchase letters so i'll go to text uh, font sorry and then i will select a font here tank italic just because it's a kind of bold uh, font so i will increase the font size here and increase it a little bit yeah here we go this one is perfect so what will happen now is i will make it to the back here i'll make it to the back of the image and then i'll copy the, the text here so what will happen is i will come to the original one the first layer and then centralize it to the center because i don't want any mistakes yeah and then for the second one i will centralize it also so we are on the second one to one that's the frontal so i will go to color and then when you go to color you see this plus icon here and then you drag this one here slide it to here to the end side here so let me do it I'll slide it here you see it is slide here so i'll just go on with it you see it's actually showing nothing so what will happen now is i'll go to my stroke here and then increase the stroke let me make this stroke to be either one or two so let me make it to be white yeah let me make it work one yeah so you actually see the effect here you actually see how to create an outline image and um, effect using the pixel that so you can actually move them by picking them and then go to here so go to here and then you can actually move it we want it to be so you can actually see how to actually use your pixel lab to create an outline text effect thank you very much for your time please do subscribe to my youtube channel thank you very much see you on the next tutorial thank you